Well, the Big Tech's Choice Awards, it is in the books. And joining us this morning is the recipient of the best taste sweet dish, Big Red Chicken Bread. Now, Brent and Juan Reeves are Congratulations. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, this is not your first go around. This is not your first rodeo. So this, <laughs> no, you've been not. here before. Yes. I'm dying to know, though, because this is basically a donut made with big red and a chicken wing stuck in the middle. Yeah, yeah. that's it. That's exactly okay. what it is. So, what made you to say, I think this is going to be fantastic? I mean, what, what was the, the genius behind that? Well, there's two geniuses that love Big Red and our staff and on our team. And then one of them is here with us today, Nancy <laughs> Vargas. Uh, she and our, our, another one of our colleagues, Ronisha Childers, they love Big Red. Mm -hmm. Last summer, they, they wanted to win Big Tex. We had had a fire at our restaurant. We were still in the rebuild mode. And so we were still catering and so we were getting ready. She wanted to do Big Red. We, wanted to do Big, we couldn't come up with a way to, to introduce the Big Red that we thought would be creative enough. Uh -huh. And then we came up with the idea of the donut. And then we thought the donut's not enough. So then Brent came out to went to our happy place, which is chicken. Right. Chicken. <laughs> oh wow! That's you know, chicken and waffles is pretty cool, yeah. right? Yeah. Right. But oh, have yeah. you ever seen chicken and donuts? No. 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 It's the sweet so savory. So you got to do something yeah. new yeah, for the absolutely. state fair of Texas. So it's a new take on the sweet savory uh -huh. chicken and waffles. And then of course. The donut looks like an inner tube. Mm -hmm. And if you're floating the river, you uh, gotta have your sunglasses on, right? That's right. I mean, look at the effort that you guys go to just by putting the sunglasses on these things. <laughs> Every single one, it's just incredible. But uh, how long did it take to perfect the recipe? Oh, about a month. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Because yeah. so. we started with, so we actually have big red soda uh -huh. in the batter. And if you think of it like a seven up cake where you, it, uh -huh. it actually yeah. helps the, Makes it rise. the rising. Right. Mm -hmm. And then uh, we, we figured out that we needed. The actual syrup from mm -hmm. Big Red to make the frosting. So mm -hmm. it's not the soda; it's actual just the syrup that you okay. used in the yeah. fountain drink. So, yeah. so did you have any expectation that you were going to get this, or did you think you might get something else? We thought that we would probably we thought we had, we had a, a chance shot. of getting most, most creative, creative. Yeah. Uh -huh. but yeah. we never would have so thought we would actually win best taste. Not that it's not great, but there are a lot of great options, right. and so we were really surprised. <laughs> okay, I'm just going to say That's... as I lean in here. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it just smells phenomenal. I mean, if you were smell-o-vision, the folks at home would say, oh, I totally get this. And don't forget, as I'm about to eat this, you can taste the Big Red Chicken Bread for yourself when the State Fair of Texas kicks off September 27th at Fair Park in Dallas. And, Jeff, you're going to have to wait a little bit to dig into yours <laughs> because you've got to tell us about the weather. That. Sorry. I choke on a chicken bone. But, uh, I have to say, it looks so happy sitting there, it's almost sad to eat. I know. Oh, I know. I, trust me, it's so good you'll no, get over it. Yeah, I, I will have no guilty conscience at all when I start on that. All right, let's talk about the weather.